Hi, I'm Congressman Pat Fallon. And if you're watching this video, you wanna be the most informed voter possible. So we labeled this section fake news to expose some of the lies that our opponents are putting out there. Now the good news, well, the good news about their lies anyhow, is that they are fortunately provably false. So let's get after it. Anyone out there that really thinks the mainstream media treats conservatives fairly is probably a dedicated liberal. We all know, the people in the independents and, the, and the, on the right know that that's just not the case. You know, and of course they don't. In fact, they haven't done it in decades. And they took it to a whole new level with President Trump. Look at the fake news hit pieces that President Trump had to endure. How about Ron DeSantis or Ted Cruz or Rand Paul? You name me a conservative and I'll show you somebody that's been, been viciously attacked by the media. It's patently unfair. What President Trump had to deal with was atrocious. My opponents are attacking me relentlessly. That's not surprising in so much as they're running against a proven conservative fighter with a rock solid voting record. So they both needed a pretext to run. So they made up a few things out of whole cloth and they'll point to a few media hit pieces that were written about me. Well, you know who knows the truth? Beyond a shadow of a doubt, President Trump does. And he's not happy about the fake news, whether they're attacking him or another fellow conservative. President Trump has endorsed me for re-election in this race. So has Senator Ted Cruz, so has Congressman and conservative stalwart Jim Jordan, the NRA, Susan B. Anthony List, the Plano and Frisco and Dallas Police Associations, the entire Denton County's Commissioner's Court, their entire GOP Texas legislative delegation, the entire Collin County legislative delegation, Collin County Judge Chris Hill, and the Collin County Commissioners, the Collin County Conservative Republicans, and scores of other elected officials, as well as thousands of people in our district. Now why? Because they know the truth. And the truth is, I've proven myself as a strong and fearless conservative fighter. I did it on the Frisco City Council, in the Texas State House, in the Texas Senate, and now in Congress for the past 14 months. So in the next few videos, I'll specifically share with you some of the fake news lies that my opponents are trying to spread and we'll debunk them one by one. Thanks so much for being the best voter you can be and doing your due diligence, as I said at the beginning. Let's fire Nancy Pelosi, stop Biden, and let's save the country.